You know what it is I love about being KRX? Everything, duh. Alright guys, the trailer for The Amazing Spider-Man 2 came out, well, depending on your definition of a long time ago, it came out April 6th, but I'm reviewing it now. Now it's not the official trailer, it's the official alternate final trailer. And the reason why I'm reviewing this one is because I had two big things I want to talk about with you guys. that are some theories and then one big thing that I know you guys will like. So let's get on! Anyways, the trailer starts out with Spider-Man. He's just having a really fun time being Spider-Man. He's web-slinging all around. He's got Emma Stone as a girlfriend. And then his friend Harry comes back to town, and they're like, it's been ten years. What, what have you been up to, my friend? What have you been up to? You're not Spider-Man, right? No, I just do some web design. And we all know by now that Harry Osborn is the Green Goblin. I mean, come on, that's not Norman Osborn on the glider. Because remember, his dad is dying. Supposedly, we all know he's not really dead. And Peter is still trying to find out what Oscorp's doing and what happened with his father and all this stuff from the first one, which the Amazing Spider-Man review is coming your way, don't worry. And then Electro comes to town on top of all the things that Peter's already got to deal with about finding his dad. Electro comes, and man, he comes in a big way. I mean, come on, he almost destroys Times Square. Well, he pretty much does destroy Times Square. And then on top of that, Rhino comes, and man, he comes busting through. That was the worst joke ever. Now, at first, I was a little worried about Rhino's costume, because all I saw was, like, the hood coming down like this. And I was like, I don't know. But then after I saw him, like, fight Spider-Man for, like, two seconds, I was like, yep, they did it. And now we get to the two big things that I wanted to talk about with you guys. And the first one involves Electro. And this isn't a spoiler because Jamie Foxx, for the tenth time, probably more now, but for the tenth time said electricity can't really die, it just goes to another place. And they're making a Sinister Six spin-off film. And so, you know, he's not dead. I mean, come on. So as I kind of said, it involves Electro's death. Now there's a scene in the trailer where there's an explosion at the power plant, which you'll see right now and Spider-Man and Electro fight there so I'm guessing that that's when Electro absorbs too much electricity or something and what well, and the next one involves the one the only Venom now there's another scene in the trailer where a guy walks past some containment cells and I want you to pay close attention to the last one he walks by did you see it yeah yeah you saw now sadly that was replaced with Rhino's costume. I know, that's not in the film. I'm, I know. Now, I haven't seen the film, and I am in America. I'm not in another country. But I found out from a guy who has seen the film. Go out and check out Steve Webheads, guys. So, overall, I think the film looks pretty good. I really like the trailer. I really like the music. I really like the villains. I really like everything. So, I'm definitely going to see The Amazing Spider-Man 2. And have you guys seen the trailer? And what did you think about the trailer? Uh, please post in the comments. And uh, later, eight guys.